All right, what's going on, everyone? It's Mega Bobson. Got my Crown Vic here at night again. So, the issue that I'm having now is, I would say, uh, okay, it started today's Monday. It started on Saturday night when I was going to pick up my kid. Um, started a rattling sound, but what's weird, what's weird is, I think it's the timing chain guide. I think from what I've researched online is there's these plastic guides for the timing chain and um, they break and then it makes the chain rattle there's also could be like a timing chain tensioner so anyways but what's funny is when I turn the heat on it rattles hardcore but when I turn it off it stops so here we go all right right now it's not rattling right I don't hear the rattle okay now, when I press the gas, you can hear this little, sounds like a, hear that, like a chain rattling sound. So, I'm gonna turn on the heat now, hardcore. Now you can definitely hear a rattling sound. Definitely sound like it's coming from passing the side and from the valve cover here. I don't know why it engages more. I think because that pulley right there engages when I turn on the heat. And that one was squeaking earlier. I put a little WD-40 in it, but it's like a little bit loose. You actually can kind of see it wobbling a little bit. But uh Here's what we have timing chain issues for the world. And you can definitely hear it on this side. And from what I've read, this is the first side that knows. So to get that fixed, I gotta take that valve cover off. I gotta pull the entire front cover of the motor off, take this out of the way. It's gonna be a real pain in the ass. I've seen guys do it on like, I saw one video online, but it, I mean, it's nothing really hardcore good that, so I'm going to make a video about it, but apparently the uh, plastic, plastic timing chain guide, it only costs like $15, but I've heard you should, just go, I mean, obviously you should just go ahead and replace the whole chain and the gears and all that, it's like $300, so I mean, if I don't got $300, I'm going to at least replace the guide, but I got to get this thing apart. So, um, this weekend, um, Saturday, I'm going to start Friday night when I get off work. I'm going to take it apart and get to it. Now, I've heard a lot of people say you can drive them, just drive it easy. You know, people drove them for 5,000 plus miles with time and chain rattle. So, I'm not going to worry about it because once I turn that heat off, watch. stops rattling really weird so I'm really confused sometimes because sometimes it does it without the time to the heat on but sometimes I can use it with that pulley on there a lot it engages, you know? so I don't know we're gonna see I got I got I gotta pull this whole damn thing apart on Friday oh whatever I enjoy working on cars, it's fun. Give me something to do. Keep me relaxed. So, let's see how it goes.